don't know what it is about this video, but I cannot just get it out. People keep calling me. Um, so the purpose of this video, because maybe I just need to cut to it. <laughs> hey y'all, y'all know who I am, Miss Mo. Um, the purpose of this video <laughs> is to just talk about how important it is to, to not neglect yourself by downplaying the power of movement. Last month was a very stressful time for me, um, both professionally, like at work, and personally. I just felt as if I was, a, a, I just felt as if I was absorbing a lot of negative energy, um, and it was draining me. And I did not know how to get that bitch off of me. <laughs> I did not know how to get it off of me, and I forgot, like because when you are listening to other people's stories when you are their kind of like support system or their 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 unlicensed therapist in a way um or if you just just listen to them just trying to be a good friend good partner whatever like you're absorbing a lot of energy that is not yours and that can be very draining and during that process although i was like yeah you know, I'm doing something good. I'm I'm being there for people who in need. I wasn't taking care of myself. And I realized that um, one way that I wasn't taking care of myself was that I forgot all about how important it is for me to exercise. Because exercise is a stress reliever. I've said this in previous videos, but like when I exercise, I don't more so like I care about like making sure my body look right and everything but it I'm not obsessed with it I when I work out I just want to just feel good and feel relaxed afterwards that that is all I'm asking for let let a bitch feel good and relaxed afterwards so that's why I like a good workout um and then you know the consequences or not the consequences but the um the results of like having a good workout session which is provides like a a good therapeutic outlet is that you might get a banging body in the process so <laughs> but yeah but i forgot all about the importance of working out when i am stressed like it if, if i don't do that i'm going to seriously fuck myself up and i did do that last month and so like it was because i was being so weighed down by so many emotions and so much pain I, it was hard for me to pick myself up to even like try to do try to exercise and so i had to change my mentality a little bit instead of saying okay come on girl it's time to exercise what i started to say to myself is come on girl you need to start to love yourself through movement just show love to your body, show love to yourself, show love to your to your mind. Just show love to the whole you that is you through movement. And so, and that is the message for this video is to remind you all to instead of approaching exercise um, and exercising and working out as a way to like make your body look good see it more so as an opportunity to just show love to your body because what happens when you don't move your body is that you get stiff and you know you see people who are older that's like always complaining about aches and pains and all of that stuff and i'd be complaining about aches too like my back be hurting <laughs> but i do realize that when my back hurts and then after i do like a 20 minute stretch I am fine. I am. I'm literally fine. And so, um, yeah, it's it just it. When you start to change your mentality about exercising and working out, to it being an opportunity to just show love to yourself um, and show love to your body through movement, it creates a very a positive relationship between you and working out. It's not something that's just superficial anymore. And it's not something that, um, yeah, I just need to get my health together. Like, yeah, you should get your health together. But also just see it as a way to just say thank you. Like, just show appreciation to your body. 
you're giving this 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 tool you're giving your body um for a reason and as a tool if you don't use it you you lose the ability to use it properly and so that's why it's like it's just very important to just show love to yourself and show love to your body through movement and that is the overall message for this video um I don't, I'm trying to make some changes with them, how I'm doing YouTube. And one idea that I wanted to do was like do a vlog series of like showing love to your body through movement. And it just shows how you can engage in like different activities. Like I'm not saying that you need to be jogging for 30 days straight. My bitch, come on. I like to jog from time to time, but no. Yeah, so that's why it's just very important to just find a way to love your body through movements that make sense to to you and um, that you actually enjoy instead of like forcing yourself. And that's another reason why going back to the running example, I'm not going to be running for no 30 days straight because I'll be seeing videos on YouTube um, like pop up about that. Like, oh, look how much weight I lost. And you like they say they jog like three miles a day or ran three miles a day. I'm like, that's good for them. Um, I'm not about to do that. Like, I enjoy jogging from time to time. Time to time. I have to be in a jogging, a running mood. If I'm not in that, why am I forcing myself to do that? No. I would rather engage in something that I truly enjoy, like um, doing like my own little at-home workout, with my own, like, with my personal weights and all that other stuff, doing yoga at home, dancing, jogging from time to time, or even walking, going for a long walk, um, or even gardening. Like, it's important. All I'm saying is that it's important to engage, to love your body through movement, and to find a type of movement or type of workout however you want to frame it, a type of movement or workout that works for you and what you actually enjoy. Like, because I feel like for somebody who, like, says that, oh, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna work out for, like, I'm going to work out every day, and then I only end up working out, like, three days, it's because the workout that I'm doing, I either get bored with it, um, that shit too hard, <laughs> That shit too hard and, and I don't have the, it's not something I'm looking forward to. Um, but for the most part, it's just like I kind of get bored with it. And so that's why I say it's just important to find a workout, find a movement that that reflects your interest and reflects your joy. And there are different types of workouts that people can do. And that's why I say it's a, it's a love through movement. Because you're engaging in things that reflects your joy. You're not trying to force it upon you. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. Um, again, I was trying to talk fast because not only do I have a meeting to go to in 10 minutes, but my phone keep ringing. And I love everybody, but I, I just want this personal time. This personal time with the world. <laughs> um, but, yeah, so that's all for me. And thank you for watching and again love your body through movement and find a movement again that works for you so but yeah <laughs> but thank you all for watching um and i will talk to you all later